Hello again everyone, it is your Black Knight, and as you can tell by my borderline appropriate clothing here, we're going to look at the Kalaharis. Yes, they're compl two completely different cars, both of which I believe have been stripped from the websites as part of the FOMO panic of 2023, when a third of the cars were removed. And I can see kind of why these would be removed, they're, they're too slow for racing. But, I mean, they are unique. I mean, there's nothing nothing quite in the game except for the fact that, that they're the same car except they're two different cars. You can't swap the roofs on these. So if you want one with a roof, you have to have this one. If you want one without the roof, you have to have this one. They're otherwise exactly the same. But naturally, you have to have, you know, one for when you actually want to have a modicum, a minor amount of protection from the sun, and another one for when you want to stand up in the car and shoot at things. Let, let's do this one first. Let's see. Should I do like one mild and one wild? And armor? I don't know how much armor you're going to get out of that, but make it a little bit better. Race brakes bumpers. Okay, we got the matte black bull bar. Secondary matte black bull bar. So, well, that's interesting. Secondary met black. Wouldn't it also therefore be black and not just secondary? Okay, it's... Let's protect the lenses. And let's see, rear bumpers. We can just... Yeah, let's just give it a better bumper on that. They're probably both of them will get funky bumpers. Rev up the engine. Straight out exhaust. Straight exit exhaust. The other one had, comes out the side. This looks like it gives it a little bit better clearance, so. Not that clearance is a big deal here. The hood, the spare tire. Now, if you go for the spare tire, that kind of limits you because it's going to look funny if you go for... If you go for a build with something other than those tires. Horn, let's see, musical... <laughs> Uh, let's see, standard. Air horn. Lights, headlights. Now we're going to leave those stock for right now. Neon kits, neon layout, on the back sides. I don't know what I'm doing with the color on this. I don't believe there's a livery. There's just a respray. There's only one color. Will this be the wild one? A totally not hunting car? Or do we want to just do two totally hunting car kind of things? Bronze would work. Olive green. Okay. We keep it olive green. Could do we could do the uh, the green lime uh, oh, I don't have lime on this one or do I you can get that if I take I can get it if I take it to if I take it to my auto shop I don't know if I have any room in my auto shop but that might be a lot of effort for not much the cream would kind of take a little of it bright purple Give that a little, give it a little bit of a funk. A bleached brown. Sienna brown. Sienna brown kind of picks up from the seats. So here we have a brown and... Do we want to go with custom wheels is the question. That's what's going to... You know, I, I add that, but do you really need a sidestep to get up into this little thing? No, no you don't, do you? That seems just dang silly. Turbo, of course we'll put a little turbo on there. Wheel type. Lowrider, chromes, there you go. Look at how narrow and silly that looks, oh my goodness. The lead sled. No, let's let's see. Let's go back here. If we go off roaders, st 
stock off-roaders. Police issue steelies. The concave five, which look how narrow that is. I you got your bead locked wheels here. But we look better chromed. I'm guessing now we're gonna go with we're gonna go with a paint scheme here. Wheel color. Go the anthracite black to match the top. Go the brown to match the highlight. Can we get beat to it brown? We are very limited in the browns. Can match up olive to olive. Not as wild as I really would have wanted here. Tire smoke will leave alone. Tire smoke will leave alone. We'll leave that go. We'll, we'll, we're going to go with windows. Light smoke on the windows. Actually does a thing. Does it make sense to have... Well, I guess this is going to be a racer. I really should put the off-roads... Uh, like the, the, put the lights on it. But, I mean, you know, does it really make sense? Does it make sense? Or should we just have this as... A dark hunting car? It is going to be pretty low anyway. It's pretty light. I don't know that it needs the advantage of having running lights on it. Just doesn't seem to fit the build, you know? Hey, we've, we've hit an objective again. That happens more often than you think. So now you see... Not a super powerful car. Not too bad, I guess. Why don't you get this up on gear? This could be fun. I mean, you know, there are certain stunt races. Some of the Oxford stunt races, I think. If you got everybody who agreed to driving Kalaharis, you could have a lot of fun. But now we gotta consider the other one. And it's the other one that we're gonna take up Shilly on. I mean, we're gonna for danger to the wind here, we're gonna have no head protection whatsoever. Does it have different modifications or is it all the same? Looking like the same. Engine, yeah, we're gonna have. There's not gonna be any electronic tuning in a car like this, okay? Straight back exhaust. Let's put the spare tire and we're gonna leave the tires alone on this one. Just for the sheer silliness of it all. Truck horn. Lights we're gonna leave alone again. Respray this time. What do we want to do? This is the hunting car. Is there a matte brown? There's olive drab and dark earth. <laughs> so the shine won't disturb the wildebeests. Desert tan, just matte black, olive drab. Making them both green seems like it's not like a thing, doesn't it? Whereas you can get so many different browns here, like a moss brown, which is almost like a green, or a wood, a wood beach brown. Sun 
saddle sienna. Look at the warmth of that sienna. Yeah, good enough for right now. Good sienna for the hunting car. With a pearlescent sienna. Perhaps a beechwood or a maple. Let's give it a maple flavor over the sienna. Or do I just want maple? Why doesn't it go back to, to where I was? That's maple. I, I think I like sienna more than... Alright, let's just move on. Well, you know, probably because... Um, skirts? No, we're not putting the side steps on. Transmission. There's no suspension mod on this. Interesting. Wheels, tires, I bulletproof them. Windows, light smoke for what that gets you. Doesn't get you much. Um, what was I looking for here? Got the wheel on the hood already. And the wheels are bulletproof. I did that. Did that, 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 that. It is a plain hunting car. I don't think you'd be able to fit an elephant in the back. So I wouldn't really want to shoot an elephant. Why would you want to shoot an elephant anyway? Do they taste good? I bet you not. I'm not a big game hunter myself. But now that we're here, we all know why we're here. My jobs. Well, I always go down to look for my jobs when they're right there. Juliet Hot Lap Room. We're gonna go up Chiliad in a point to point GTA. Call off your off roaders. Now we're gonna go and play. Okay, let's. Noon, clear, just like it would be in the middle of the Kalahari, wherever that is in Africa, I assume. I don't know. I don't really know the basis for the whole thing. I have two of these. I must have bought a brawler thinking I couldn't have. I forgot I had one. I don't really need two. Can't get another one again, so we'll have to. Find that, sell that. Because I definitely need parking. The custom Kalahari. Kind of matches my shirt here. Not that this is going to be a, a normal thing, but we're driving this. I'm of two minds about this and how this is going to go. Number one, this is an off-roader. And it should be able to get out me out of this. It should have been able to do that. It, it did not. Now we're going to be behind the train unless we're very, very lucky. He will use the off angle kick. Alright, that went very well. Maybe try to beat the troll. The bush stopped it. It doesn't like bushes. Or rocks. We are broadside in front of the train. Here comes the train again. Running in my car like a mad tragedy. Okay, we're just gonna not try and make up lyrics on the fly and fumble through them. We're just gonna drive. We beat the train. It is powerfully affected by bushes. This is probably because it weighs all of 8 pounds. I exaggerate, but still, it's a light, tiny little machine. Can we get it up on the rails? Very nearly, yeah! It, 
good rail rider. Those tiny little tires. So again, as I was saying, I have two minds about this. It's an off-roader. It should do well going off-road, right? On the other hand, it's not very fast. Not very powerful. So what's going to happen? I honestly don't know. We're going to see. This is really science. I'm trying to avoid the bushes because they'll bog it right down. This is not feeling powerful. I am not getting gobs of confidence yet. We're just going to see. Don't get stuck in the bush. Can it do it? I think it might. Gobs of traction, I guess. If not power. The Kalahari. Oh, those bushes really grab it, though. Which is odd for a car that's made to be out in the bush. I do feel ignorant of the term Kalahari. The only place I know that's the Kalahari is a, a water park. Just down the road from, from us here. But there we are! We have done it! Made it to the top! Seems to be an extremely competent uh, off-roader. Will it have the brakes to keep itself under control going down? Are we going to die? That's the kind of question I'm asking. Now. Coasting. Coasting. Okay, we're on the right side of that. Ooh. Definitely bouncy bouncing. Transition. Not as well as I'd hoped. We didn't get up to the... Ugh. Okay, we're, we're, we're completing the transition that way. Whoa! I think we got launched by a bush. Into a tree. Ow, 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 ow. That would have been a neck injury. No question about it. We are not going to make it against the train. No question about it. Are we narrow enough and small enough to fit through? Yes, well, we might have, but... We pointed to it. The opening was there. You kind of had it. Do I put, put, do I put, do I put the non-matching spare tire on the other vehicle as if it's a spare tire for this vehicle, as it's a support vehicle for when we go hunting big game? And yeah, it doesn't have to be with rifles. I mean, you have to have rifles there in case they come to eat you. You have to be able to defend yourself. But yeah, you know, it could be a photo safari. photo safari in the Kalahari. That sounds like a thing to do. It has been done, though, you know? I remember once... Oh, this is... Man, so many years ago. 20, 30 years ago. I was watching a special uh, about a guy who's a big game hunter kind of thing. Photo Photography-wise. Photo safari kind of thing. And a bunch of photographers are out there, and there was a rhino they were trying to photograph. And one of the guys got too close to the rhino. 
and it gored him with its horn and flipped it in the air behind him and tossed him. And the guy who was narrating it said, well, they all run up to the guy, he said, surprisingly, there was very little blood. And I remember that, like, i more than 30, I'm going to be 35. It's a long time ago. And the guy lived. He eventually, you know. Can, can we go up this hill anyway? I think it can. Let's let's do this. Yeah, there you go. Kalahari. The guy lived. It was like a three-hour trek to the back to like some kind of town where there's a hospital. Probably a major to city because you need a major city to have someone's guts rearranged after they were gored by a rhino. But you know, I remember thinking, yeah, I don't, I don't necessarily want to do this. This isn't. <laughs> I don't want to sneak up on rhinos. That that was. You know. I've always been into photography, but not necessarily. Oh wow, there you go. Finally, some some serious damage there. Right at the end. Well, you know, you can at least take a look at it, I guess. You won't have to, um... There's change the viewpoint. Won't have to pop the hood. Haha! <laughs> and there you have it. Looks like a, uh... Inline 4 kind of thing. Turboed up. Excuse me. Hey, honey, how are you? Don't mind me. I'm just standing right here. Kalahari. Kal it's a fun little thing and you can't get it anymore. Like, when is the Kalahari gonna be. You know, at Simeon's? When is that gonna be a thing? And which one will it be? Will it be the one without the top? Will it be the one with the top? I don't think you get me, I'm misspeaking. Maybe Rockstar will have already, you know. Repented of their sins here and they'll let us have all these cars back by the time you see this. I don't know. Yeah. You can only hope, I guess. Rockstar, you gotta repent of your sins. Repent of your sins. Your sins need to be repented. Repented? Is that a word? I don't even think that's. Kalahari. I have to change this outfit. It feels cool, yet too warm somehow. I feel like there's chafing involved. I'm not sure why. It does seem to beg for the 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 wheel on the hood, doesn't it? Let's do that. Okay, let's take a hop over here. Good. Spare tire it. Yes, the spare tire doesn't match. But it's for this car. So it's the support vehicle. And now I'm ready to go on a, a safari of some nature. A Kalahari safari. Who's coming with me? <laughs> I'm the only one who's allowed to drive either one, so game mechanics. Problematic. That's something that you should work on, Rockstar. Let us let our friends drive our cars. So come in here, pick something, take it out, go do things together. That'd be awesome. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.